I'm back. Rodrance on this POS known as New Warriors. We are gathered here today to celebrate such new characters as Safe Space, a real candy ass if there ever was one, a black person named Snowflake. And the unheart healthy, cheeseburger loving, asthma inhaler using, we keep forgetting the great trailblazer. My personal favorite from this new Warrior series. Okay, I can totally relate to chasing a bad guy, having to stop after 25 feet and take a hit off my asthma inhaler. Exactly what I was looking for for my comic heroes. Fuck a Superman. Yeah, fuck Captain America. I wanted this some bitch. Today, let's talk about the fact that this piece of shit trailer now has 202,000 dislikes. And you may be thinking, Jesus, man, people are... That pissed off over identity politics and bullshit in their fucking comics. Well, yeah, we are. But in this particular case, Marvel did the unbelievable and actually succeeded in getting all sides pissed off at them. The Social Justice Warriors, as I did a video on, they are pissed off about because they think they're being made fun of. It is so in your face on almost a parody level. But wait, when you think this could be a parody, you realize when you see the author, Daniel, I love to get pegged, Kibblesmith. Uh, when you see the fact that he once wrote something called Santa's Husband. You some bitch. When he writes something called Santa's Husband. This shit is real. Just nasty. Oh, I'm not supposed to say that? You got the wrong channel, Jack. I'm going to bring the heat. I don't give a fuck. So, as the comic book industry is dying, dying, as mom and pop shops are dying, the sad part is now that the bug is out there, it's like, between this and Gotham High and The Bug, it is like a triple trifecta of death for comic shops. And it's so sad. We all love to go into a comic shop. Somebody told me, well, we don't buy comics in a comic shop anymore anyway. Horse to the shit. You walk in the comic shop on comic shop day, comic book day, and you walk up to the little cardboard boxes, you know, and you're flipping through. And the thing about buying comics, you're not there to just buy your new favorite comic. But you're there to flip through. You're flipping through the comics. And you pull out that one, and you're like, God dang, this Flash has got an awesome cover on it. I think I'll just buy this. The comic may suck, but this cover is going to look great up on the wall. Some of us do just that. I've got comics on my wall next door. Savage Hawkman. That's got a badass... De good, good, decent comic, but it's got a badass cover on it. We walk over. We look at the toys in the comic shop. We want to see the t-shirts. Oh, and the posters. We forget about all this when it comes to the mom and pop comic shop. And you can thank bullshit like this... For putting a silver bullet directly in their eye hole. New Warriors and your 200,000 dislikes. Marvel, if you don't learn a lesson from this shit, as a brand, you deserve to die. Along with Lucasfilm. Tell me what you think, Road Squadron. 
New Warriors 200,000 beautiful dislikes. Peace. I'm out. Till next time. King Kong in the trunk. King Kong, 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 King Kong,